hello and welcome back to the tutorial in this video I'm gonna show you how to get and uh, show the score in the game so first of all uh, we need to organize the game sheet I'm gonna do it real quick okay now let's create a new variable I'm gonna call this score and create a new group get and show score whoa score okay hit B and F button get the score and put this blank event underneath of this function and here I want to say when uh, arrows Y is between these two image points we should get uh, one score so double click here arrow compare y is bigger than uh, target dot image point y of one copy paste and this already color than number two that, that, that means uh, it's between these two image points then we uh, get a, a score so I'm gonna hit B button and F button for showing a score show a score and hit P button for creating a par parameter I'm gonna call this value type of number and put this uh, blank event here and here I want to say add action functions show a score value is 1 I'm gonna do uh, the same thing for uh, for the other image points for example if it's between 2 and 3 we get 2 a score here we get 3 a score and here we get 5 and here we get 10 a scores and uh, so on so I'm gonna copy and paste it several times Okay, now uh, we need to show the uh, score. For showing that, I need a, uh, a sprite font that I already created. I'm gonna just copy and paste it here real quick. And this is it, okay? Uh, this one is, uh, have this color, this yellow color. And the font is righteous, as you can see and I already uh, talked about how to create a sprite font uh, so you can use this, use the suggestion link as I uh, mentioned okay now we have this object with this name and have this tween behavior so let's go in game sheet and add action system create object object is text in US score on hot on position of target dot X and target dot e box top uh, minus 20 and uh, text is score set text text is plus and percent uh, what's the value and we use value okay now add action takes senior score uh, this one needs a uh, animation tween position x is stable self dot x and y is self dot y minus 50 in time of half of seconds uh, half of half a second and uh, out quantic I'm gonna copy and paste it here get back between one property for opacity and value is going to be zero in time of half eases out quantic and of course it needs to be destroyed on complete and then we need to add to a score variable add to score value okay 
Now uh, we need to call this function after shoot. So we hit target and here at action functions uh, get a score. Okay, let's run. Okay. This one is uh, this object, we need to dis destroy it at first. So in create, on a startup layout, I'm gonna delete it and let's get back to, to the game. Okay, this is so far, but it's working. Okay, tennis score. Okay, now we need to uh, call a function to recreate everything after shoot. So after getting a score, we need to recreate everything, call this function. So at action system, wait for 0.5 seconds and at action functions, create objects. And uh, we need to set shoot to zero. Okay, let's run. All right, uh, this is working very well, but we got a problem here. When we shoot the arrow outside of the layout, we cannot do anything here. So let's get back to the code in game sheet. Uh, here, we want to say when arrow is outside of the layout, we should create new objects and set shoot to zero and of course we should change the escort to zero because we lost the game okay hit run all right now let's uh, show the escort here i'm gonna clone this object put it here and make it bigger make the color white and change text to zero doesn't matter and let's change it to txt score I'm gonna clone this object for best score make the scale to maybe 70 and change the name to txt best score okay and uh, let's go back here copy and paste this score and change it to best score okay so uh, right click add group score hit b button i'm gonna uh, i'm gonna add a local storage object for saving best score so here let's say on a startup layout at action local storage check item exists arrows best copy hit p button double click local storage on item exists paste here and here at action system set value best score to local storages value okay now we need to show a score and uh, save best score so first uh, I'm, I'm gonna save best score so double click here system compare variable if a score is bigger than best score at action system set value a score um, best score is going to be score and here at action local storage set item this one set best score uh, we save best score in this key okay now hit b button add action takes the best score set text to best ampersand best score copy and paste Text the score, set text 
to score just like this hit run okay uh, our best score is 35 I'm gonna clean the local storage or make it zero okay it's zero now and we got this best score I'm gonna close and run again we got this best score it's working very well okay thanks for watching uh, that was the whole tutorial of arrows game in construct 3 like and subscribe for more videos and tutorials see ya